I'm Betsy Gibbon with today's Ag Day Minute. It has become America's most COVID infected metro area and it's shutting down its outdoor dining again. Los Angeles County is shutting down outdoor dining on Wednesday. That includes breweries, wineries and bars. Drive through takeout and delivery services will be allowed. The change in order is scheduled to last three weeks. It's been a big year for butter. Farm Journal's Dairy Herd reporting over the last several months there has been a large uptick in home baking and cooking, and that has caused butter consumption to rise. According to USDA, butter production has risen 6% over the first nine months of the year and is on track to top 2 billion pounds for the first time since 1943. One dairy cooperative taking advantage of the boom is Lando Lakes. According to a company statement, net earnings rose during the third quarter of this year, largely due to a surge in retail butter sales. Meet this year's national Thanksgiving turkey contestants. Their names? corn and cob. The two birds, along with leaders of the National Turkey Federation, now in Washington ahead of Tuesday's White House event, where one will be pardoned by President Trump. And you can help decide which one gets that pardon by going to the White House Twitter page and casting your vote. Both birds come from the Cardell family in Walcott, Iowa. And no matter which bird gets the pardon, both will be retired and live out their days at Iowa State University. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on the station or anytime at agweb.com.